there's a concrete truck. I'm doing some work, possibly a pool or something, on this property over here. So I will give you the information a little bit um, closer into the property where it won't be so noisy. So this area right here is the downstairs to the tri-level. And this area is actually 10 by 7, 9. And then into the family room, just past this little area that could be a sitting area, um, this particular room is 13 by 15. Really nice um, shelves. Fan is, is, is basic. Um, it goes into um, the powder room that does have Corian as well. I, it seems like Corian, and it could be that cultured stone, but it's, it's definitely not um, laminate. So the light fixture, basic um, restroom and shower. The shower is actually in really good condition. And then underneath, you know, it's just always hard to tell when people live here. There's amazing pride of ownership here. It's, it's just this house is pristine. Okay, so this particular room they use as an office. The office equipment will be going. And this room will have to be primed, of course, like the kitchen. Um, but there will be some holes in the wall, he said. So, just a basic closet. Um, upper and a lower. We do need a rod here. And we've got the verticals, no electric and no fan for the um, the ceiling. So, okay. So then, so this tile is all the same tile that's in the kitchen. They have it at different angles and different sizes and different places. Looks like this one and this one match. It's a smaller version of this one, just a tad lighter, but it, it blends beautifully. Okay, so this hall, uh, excuse me, that hall bath, hmm, I already gave you that information. Laundry room, eight by six, eight. That's the stairs, little stair um, arch. And so this is just a, kind of a, a green, grayish green tone. It's actually not bad, it might not have to be repainted. The garage has um, a garage door that works beautifully. Um, nice cabinetry that's set back, it doesn't uh, interfere with two cars getting in the garage and once everything's moved this whole area will have to probably be painted. This is a little side um, gate. The gate's painted beautifully. Um, nice little walkway with rock. We'll go out in the back in a second. Okay, so through the laundry room and family room, we've got some nice double doors, and they're they're definitely a higher quality, higher grade. We've got we've got great, beautiful slate out here um, with little stepping stones. I mean, just amazing pride of ownership in this home. Uh, the pool is a self-cleaning pool. Pebble Tech. Let's see if you can see that better. And this is the back patio. Let's see. The air conditioning unit looks almost brand new. And the house really doesn't look like it needs to be painted anywhere but up in that little corner on the side. Maybe this little spot right here could use a little, you know, touch up. I guess that's where they filled in a couple of spots. It's a little tiny hairline crack right there. But the air conditioning unit and um, pool pumper right here. 
And then this, this section of grass does have a sprinkler system. Okay, so the patio does not have sheetrock underneath it, but it is painted nicely. It's been freshly painted, you can tell. And good, you know, they've got gutters. That's, that's nice. Nice change in some of these properties. Okay. All the screens are in place. And then we'll go upstairs. So here's the stairs to go up to the little eating area and kitchen. Entrance, living room, stairs. The wood laminate is in excellent condition, done very well. Oh, there's no light on there. Okay, there we go. Okay, this is the master bedroom, 13 by 17. Will need to be primed. Carpet seems in really good condition up here. Up here, I wasn't really sure about this back. Um, this is the patio. Um, it looks like it's just been, all the nails have been puttied so that it doesn't take a chance to leak. I didn't see any signs of leaking. I don't know if you can see that from here. So it's, it doesn't look pretty, but if it's done for efficiency, then good thing. Okay, so from here, there's the double door entrance. This is the master bath. This is 5'5 five five by 10 with a garden tub. Um, we've got some verticals. This is the backyard. This house is actually in foreclosure right here next door, so that should be cleaned up soon. Everybody else seems to take really good care of their properties. And then this is the same type of counter that's downstairs. Basic light. We do have a nice skylight. And there's the bedroom. We've got a closet. Um, pretty good sized. And this particular closet is seven and a half by nine and a half. And the shower is in good shape. Cabinets are actually a little bit different than throughout the rest of the house. Um, they're, they're, they're very nice looking though. And then we have a private restroom, of course. So. Okay. The hall bath is five by six and then five, seven by five in here. Uh, the counters um, are just a blue and white, two shades of blue and white um, speckles, Corian. Uh, basic lights, and then we do have the same skylight. Great tile, it's good condition. Okay, so this particular bedroom is 11 by 11 and a half verticals, fan, and light, and then this closet's a little bit longer and split. It does have one rod missing here at the base. And then there's a, a hall cabinet that matches the other um, cabinets in the bathrooms. That is um, a linen closet. Now this is the only flooring that doesn't match the rest of the laminate, but it's it, it's it's tasteful. It's done tastefully. It's just a lighter version and smaller planks, and then this these built-in shelves that kind of coordinate with it. We've got um, verticals here. This will need to be primed as well. The other bedroom doesn't really need to be primed, but the one downstairs does as as well. So we've got a fan that's. Um, in good condition, and then we have a nice walk-in closet. This particular walk-in closet is four by five. So uh, that paint is a kind of a green tone that will definitely have to be primed. This hall is actually the color 
I think that the whole house, you want the whole house to possibly be. So that probably won't need to be painted. So from this is basically the master and then to, to go downstairs. So it's a lovely, lovely property. Just really well taken care of and very nice. Thank you for joining us on another video tour. We are Ron and Christina Wilczek, Metro Phoenix Homes. Feel free to give us a call at 480-445-9480 or see us on the web at metrophoenixhomes.com. Thanks and have a blessed day.